What's up guys, Shehbaz here. So after the Samsung Galaxy S23 and Galaxy S23 Plus were reported to have obtained FCC certification in the United States, the Galaxy S23 Ultra also suspected to have passed. Some product specifications have been exposed, but the rumored fast charging rate may be reduced compared to the previous generation. In addition, the Samsung SmartThings Station wireless charger with the model number EP-P9500, which has previously obtained Bluetooth SIG certification, has also passed the FCC, supporting 15 watts wireless out power and IoT-related technologies such as the Zigbee communication protocol. The new Samsung phone certification data with the model number SMS918B appeared in the FCC certification database. Since the internal module of the Taiwan version, the Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra is SMS9080. The aforementioned SMS918B is speculated to correspond to the European version of the Galaxy S23 Ultra model. The machine is confirmed to support 5G network, Wi-Fi 6, UWB, NFC, S Pen Stylus operation, wireless charging, and wireless power sharing functions, built-in Qualcomm Smart Transit Smart Antenna architecture, so it is expected to use Qualcomm Snapdragon mobile platform. According to the certification information, Samsung's new SMS918B has Qualcomm Smart Transmit Smart Antenna architecture. Among them, the new machine is equipped with the S Pen Stylus of model number EJPS918, which is produced by Wacom. So, it is expected that SMS918B is the same as Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra model. It is equipped with vacuum stylus operation sensing components and related technologies. In addition, the document revealed that the S Pen of SM918B can also be inserted into the phone for storage and wireless charging. Samsung SMS918B supports S Pen stylus operation and is tested with a 25 watts charger. The certification information also shows that the SMS918B battery model is EB BS918 ABY. The battery has certified by Safety Korea, Brazil Anatel, and other units. The rated power is 4855 mAh, and the converted typical power is about 5000 mAh battery, which is also the same as the power of the Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra model. Interestingly, the SMS918B was tested with the 25 watts charger of the model number EPTA800, so the fast charging rate may be reduced from the previous generation 45 watts specifications to 25 watts. Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra's built-in battery has passed multiple certifications. Recently, Samsung's application information for EPP9500 also appeared in the FCC certification database. It is confirmed that it is a wireless charger that supports QI wireless charging technology or 4.5 watts charging specification. Devices with Bluetooth headset and smartwatches can switch to 2 watts, 4.5 watts, and 7.5 watts charging power. Among them, the Zingbee communication protocol is mainly used in automation equipment, wireless sensor devices, remote control equipment, and many smart home IoT devices also support the aforementioned specifications. Therefore, the EPP9500 that supports Zingbee technology should be a wireless charger equipped with Samsung SmartThings Smart IoT function. It is expected that the new Galaxy S23 line will officially launch early next year. That's it for now. For more updates, please subscribe to our channel Science and Knowledge. Until the next video, take care of yourself very well. Peace out.